This is a view on my Redstar AKM. I know I've reviewed it before. It wasn't really a review though. That was more of a first impression type thing. This is a review after it's been tried and true. Um, I know it looks a lot different than it did when I first bought it. The, the, all the upgrades are external. Um, the sling came with my D-Boys AK. I don't know if I mentioned that. To my Leaper's Red Dot. There's a the rail mount there, and I wrap the sling around it just because, well, I think it kind of looks neat, and it's easier for storage when the sling's not getting caught on everything. And my working silencer, so that quiets it down a lot. Um, the gun is real wood and full metal. I mean, not much else. I mean, as far as externals go, it's one other than VFC, in my opinion. It's one of the best you can get, and yeah, it's, I don't, the camera angle might be shifty a little bit, because I had to move the camera to show you a few things. Um, I don't know exactly how it's going to do that, because I'm filming on my iPod, so I apologize for that. Um, anyway, here's just the profile of the gun, it's a pretty thin gun, I mean, it's, it's not big and bulky, I mean, it's around the same profile as an M16. Most modern assault rifles are. There are a few little bulkier. I believe the G36s are not as slim. Anyway, it's an AK. You guys pretty much all know AKs. The gun, it's really good. The only real gripe I have about it is the rear sight fell off. Now the front sight was made out of pot metal. That cracked off. So, see there. But I have a red dot, so that's really not an issue for me. Um, the gun's really nice. It shoots well. It reaches out to at least 250, 250 feet with the hop up rate. Everything in the right day. Obviously, you could shot, you know, 250, between 220 and 250, I want to say it's fair range. And it's all stock. The FPS is around 430, I think, right out of the box. It's probably somewhere around 410, 400 right now. Um, I love it to death. Probably going to be adding some new things to it. It's, guys, it's just a good gun. I mean,. There's not much really to go in depth about. The rate of fire is average. I believe it's 16 rounds per second. Or a little less, maybe 14. Between 14 and 16 rounds a second. Um, it's a good gun. If you're thinking about buying it, buy it. I mean, this KWA doesn't make AKs. Otherwise, they tell you to get the KWA one. Um, KWA M16s are great. I'm very impressed with mine, by the way. I'm going to be doing a real review on that soon. Um, but yeah, I would, unless you want to get a VFC, get one of these. These or a D-Boys, which I have right here. Um, the D-Boys, of course, is an AK-74, but internally, the 47s and the 74s are the same. Spin Nick with another review. It's a quickie. Catch you guys later.